so hi everyone welcome back to data science in your pocket and today we are talking about a very exciting ocr model that looks to be state of the art called as dots ocr and this is just not a machine learning model but can be taken as an ocr llm yes you heard it right you need to give it a prompt and eventually based on that it does the ocr not just that it supports tables formulas different languages about 100 plus including kannad hindi french german whatever you can think of and what not so here is one of the examples as you can see on my screen later on we'll talk about the model also so this is an image that i passed it through and below is the output it is able to extract the entire table exactly the same way phenomenal now if we change the image there are multiple examples given. Let's try out Kannad. So this is a paper which has Kannad language, an Indian native, as you can see on my screen. It has formulas also, if you notice. So once I click on parse, this might take some time, as you can see. It is getting queued up also because everyone is using the same server, I guess. But the model looks amazing. You can also change out the prompt OCR. And here's the current prompt that has been given. Please output the layout information for the PDF image, including each layout's elements B box, its category and corresponding text content within the B box. So it will be highlighting the boxes also, not just giving an OCR. Could can be very good for if you're going for prescription digitization or any other legal document digitization also. And the model is quite lightweight. I think if I remember correctly, it is about 1.5 billion parameters and looks quite good. Our output is now ready as you can see. Every box has been highlighted and if you go down the extraction has been quite amazing including the formulas. You can see the subscripts, superscripts also, the degree sign, the formulas, Kannad language, everything is coming quite perfectly. Let's try out a third example and then we'll jump on to the details of the model so this is a different orientation as you can see just to test out that not just straight it can handle different orientations as well and let's pass this out let's see how much time it takes now the extraction looks ready and the extraction looks quite amazing here so there are different formats also the model supports markdown.x current json as well and the model looks quite interesting now let's jump on to the details of the model so this is dots.ocr by red note high labs again coming from china the model is quite amazing it is giving sota performance as already mentioned that we'll be discussing quite soon and if you look into the performance benchmark it is the best ocr model for now and that to the size of the model is quite small the model weights are available for free to download and you can get it from hugging face as we usually do so here's the model weights present there are two safe tensor files that you can see about six gbs in memory i would say and looks quite affordable as well so here we are dots dot ocr best ever ocr llm that too with 1.7 billion parameters and it is able to outperform Gemini Pro as well, 2.5, which is the best LLM so far. Old OCR versus dots OCR, if you look, in case of traditional OCR models, there are multiple pipelines that work in, right? You don't have a direct uh, LLM that can intake what you want to as an output and giving you an OCR. But in case of dots OCR, it's an OCR LLM itself. You can give it a prompt what sort of a format you want as an output and you would get it. One model, many talents, layout detection, it can detect the uh, layout of the page, text parsing, text understanding, table understanding, formula detection, and what not. Outperforming the giants, that's for sure. It is able to beat out models that are 20 times bigger than it. Beyond English, yes, 100 plus languages are supported. And whatever language you can think of, the most important ones are covered by the model. So I think for OCR, I think now looks like dots.ocr is the best model out there, beating out NanoNets 2. 
deployment is quite easy vllm hugging face docker whatever you support i think dots ocr will support that too room to grow i think there are certain issues that the team has mentioned high density images images with very high pixel rate are need to be down sampled uh characters like epilepsies and underscores causes repetition bug no picture parsing it can't understand pictures i think in case of nanonets that was not the case and limited throughput it is not optimized for big pdfs future is unified obviously yes this isn't an ocr now it's an llm ocr so be aware of that too get started i think the model demonstration is free to use i will be sharing the link in the comment section and even the model weights are present on hugging face the model is not that huge so you should be able to run into your local system also with this we wrap this up i hope this was useful